Hello and welcome to this new two minutes video from Cancel. In this video, we'll speak about the TSC5 battery charging troubleshooting, recommendations, best practices, and preventative maintenance. The Trimble TSC5 controller is powered by an internal battery back, which is not removable. However, you might notice that you can also have an external battery as well with the unit. This extra battery, the LI35, can be added to the back of the unit. In the following slides, we will provide the battery symbol that may be present on the TC5, the descriptions, and troubleshooting recommendations. Let's start with this symbol. This symbol indicates that the device needs a charger inserted into the USB Type-C port to charge the battery. The power LED will be off. Please note that if the Trimble supplied USB Type-C bar delivery charger is not inserted, this symbol may still be present, as some chargers may not provide enough power to both charge and also power the device at the same time with stability. The troubleshooting for this, the user should always use the Trimble supplied power delivery charger. Another symbol that might show up to you is this one. This symbol indicates that the bootloader, which is the program that loads the operating system when the TSC5 is turned on. The bootloader is basically trying to charge the batteries, the internal one or the external one or the combination of them. The, the, the bootloader is trying to charge the batteries to bring them out of the CUV state to the good state. Basically, the CUV is the cell under voltage. This state happens when the battery back voltage is lower than the, uh, the predetermined level. So what will happen that the put loader will stay in this state uh, for 30 minutes, trying to charge the battery until they reach, till they reach the, uh, the good state mode. Uh, for troubleshooting for this case, please leave the TSC5 on the Trimble provided charger to bring the unit out of the CUV state to the good state. The next symbol that we will discuss about is this one. This means the batteries are good. The symbol will be shown briefly to the user after the charging has finished and the put loader can continue to, the, uh, to either put the operating system or to the charging only screen. Please note in this, uh, when this show up, the power LED will be off. There's nothing that you should do in this case. The next symbol will be this one. This symbol basically indicates that the battery is either in a permanent failed mode or failed communication mode. So basically the bootloader cannot boot the operating system. And actually what you'll have to do is to return to cancel service center to receive a replacement for your internal battery. You might have this kind of simple shop to you. This is in case of you are using the external uh, LI35 battery with the internal battery. In this case, um, the, the troubleshooting recommendation is to remove the external battery first and try to uh, uh, turn on the machine again. And if you still have the same problem, this indicates that the problem with the internal battery, if it's put up, worked perfectly, this means that the problem is with the external battery. The last part of this video will be dedicated for battery maintenance best practices. Let's start with charging. It's best to let the battery run below 10% at least once a month before you recharge it. Battery recharging is supported at temperature between 0 degree to positive 40 degrees Celsius. For optimal charging conditions, use only the Trimble designated charging accessories. For ideal operating conditions, please note that TC5 is designed to work in ambient temperature range negative 30 degrees to positive 60 degrees. Stored in temperature range negative 40 degrees to positive 70 degrees. And avoid exposing the device to dramatic changes in temperatures or humidity. For long-term storage recommendations, the device can be placed into shelf mode for shipping or long-term storage, 30 days or more. Trimble recommends the device be charged at least 30% percent 
before being uh, boot in shelf mode. Shelf mode, to activate it, go to settings, battery, advanced, shelf mode enable, and select OK. For the recommended storage conditions, battery life can be shortened if the device is stored outside of the recommended temperature ranges, which are negative 40 degrees to positive 70 degrees. The device should be kept out of direct sun for long periods. Please do not leave the device in a hot car. Thank you. That's all for our two minutes video. See you next time.